types of sets empty set singleton set finite set infinite set equal sets equivalent sets universal set subset proper subset superset proper superset power set empty set a set with no element this is the symbol of an empty set let's name it set e another way of writing set e is using the symbol the null set the cardinality of set e is equal to zero this notation simply means the number of elements singleton set a set with one element set s is a singleton set the cardinality of set s is one finite set a set with limited elements example set f is the set of counting numbers less than six the elements of set f are one two three four five the cardinality of set f is five infinite set a set with unlimited elements example set n is the set of counting numbers the elements of set n are 1, 2, 3, and so on. The cardinality of set n is infinite. Equal sets. Two sets are equal if they have the same elements. Example. Set E is a set of letters in the word Earth. The elements of set E are E-A-R-T-H. Set H is a set of letters in the word heart. The elements of set H are H E A R T. Set E and set H have the same elements. They are equal sets. Set E equals set H. Equivalent sets. Equivalent sets have different elements but have the same number of elements example given set f and set h the cardinality of set f is 5 and the cardinality of set h is 5 the two sets have different elements but they have the same number of elements set f is equivalent to set h universal set Universal set is the set containing all elements and of which all other sets are subsets. The universal set is represented by a capital letter U. Example, let U be the universal set. Set U is the set of all vowels in the English alphabet. All other sets are subsets of the universal set. Set a is a proper subset of set U. Set B is also a proper subset of set U. All the elements of sets A and B are also found in the universal set. Another example, set U is the set of counting numbers. Sets A, B, and C are proper subsets of set U because a universal set contains all the elements in a particular problem subset set a is a subset of set b if and only if every element in a is also an element in b here's an example list all the possible subsets of set a number one a set with three elements two three four sets with one element 5, 6, 7 sets with two elements. And number 8 is an empty set. How many subsets does set A have? To find the number of subsets, use this formula 2 to the power of n, where n is the number of elements. The cardinality of set A is 3. So 2 to the power of 3 is just 2 times 2 times 2 equals 8 proper subset set a is a proper subset of set b if there is at least one element in b 
not contained in A. In symbol, set A is a proper subset of set B. Example, given sets A, B, C, and D. Set B is a proper subset of set A. Set C is a proper subset of set A. Set D is a proper subset of set A. List all the proper subsets of set A. Sets 1, 2, 3 have two elements. Sets 4, 5, 6 have one element. And number 7 is an empty set. The set itself is not a proper subset of set A. How many proper subsets does set A have? Since the set itself is not a proper subset, the formula is 2 to the power of n minus 1, where n is the number of elements. The cardinality of set A is 3. Using the formula, 2 to the power of 3 minus 1 equals 8 minus 1 is 7. Superset. Superset is a set containing all of the elements of another set. In symbol, set A is a superset of set B. This is just a reverse of subset. Proper superset. Set A is a proper superset of set B if set A is a superset of set B and set A is not equal to set B. In symbol, set A is a proper superset of set B. Given set A and set B, while set B is a proper subset of set A, set A is a proper superset of set B. Power set. The set of all the subsets of a set. What is the power set of set S? P of S contains all the subsets of set S. How many elements does the power set of set S have? Since a power set contains all the subsets of a given set, it follows the formula 2 to the power of n, where n is the number of elements. So the number of elements of P of S is 2 to the power of 3, which is equal to 8.